wasn't the kind of man you ever turned your back to, but he didn't deserve to go out like that. Uh, I guess not. Uh, but then I guess Dan Lane didn't deserve to get shot in the back either. <sighs> Point well taken. See ya, Deke. Iron Mike out. See ya. All right, on that note, let's go check out this camp. This is Copeland's camp. As you can tell, it's in the middle of a nice foresty, wooded area. It's got pretty trees, which is great. Boulders, some of them have moss or perhaps lichen growing. Dude up there has a towel hanging out. Not sure that's sanitary. Somehow, though, they managed to keep the leaves that are on their bases green. That's kind of cool. So let's head in. See what's going Open on over here. Mm hmm thanks. I like to test each place out. So doing some donuts. Uh, oh, and uh, mm, look at that. See, just cut it up. Let everybody know you've arrived. Good place to set up. All right. Got a shop down here with plenty of wheels and tires. Handful of license plates. Wonder what that's for. Storage in the back. Little lantern over there. So, hey, Dink, how's it going, mostly. man? Hey, man. It's good. Um, gas tanks and maybe chassis. Chassis is chassis. Hey, hanging up. Merchant over there. He really probably wants a better roof set up for his weapons. This lady. The bounties, easy to get to. I like that it's all centralized here. Hey, talk to you in a minute, Cope. So all that stuff, fishing. Uh, ooh. Let's watch this guy cut some logs. Bam! Nailed it. All right. Plenty of wood. I don't know how he's storing it down there. Watch this. Ooh, that's good. Fishing. So I guess the little freaks can't come across the water of the river there. What is this guy doing? Almost looks like Lars Ulrich. Let's go check out some upstairs areas. Got plenty of boxes. For whatever reason. How do the boxes not decompose? Let me see if I can get in here and ask these guys. Are y'all aware the boxes are out and it's thundering? Gonna rain, it's, cardboard is largely based upon they plants. Okay, them. never mind. Whatever. Like been it's into gonna, or if you'll, yep. Extra generator down there. But you're stone cold. Yeah, you just shrugged it off. Did he talk about Stone Cold Steve Austin? Did he survive? DTA. All right, plenty of boxes over here. I don't know how they got that log that's sticking the wall, but it's good. And the other. Man, it's like they built a lot of these little areas way out into nowhere. I like the views, though. Cover up your radio, dude. Why do we have this out here? Breaker 1-9, Breaker 1-9. Got some storms coming in over. Come back. You got your ears on? Okay. Recycle bin? Is this being optimistic? Look at that mountain back there. Okay, let's keep going. So they do have the benefit of the trees, and it would be really hard to get up here. Not really digging the fact that it's all open. Okay, again, what's all this trash and boxes and junk on the ground? Take out the trash, people. Mm hmm. Okay. It's, what's going on with this guy? His right foot is stuck. Are you stuck in the ground, sir? Do you require assistance? We've never been to Oregon. I've never been to Oregon. It is weird that they all stand around with weapons drawn. Maybe they're really protective of their trees and cardboard. Another generator. This copes probably area. His guns are just on the wall too. Weird that he puts the little flannel up here, but not over anything else. And when I say flannel, I mean protective pouch. Hey, what's going on? You see anything? I'm doing a video for the YouTubes. All right, well, I'm uh, gonna let you get. Okay. 
muddy down here. That's gross. This is going to lose a lot of points. Look at all that. Ooh, they do have green cotton candy, which is probably cool. <gasps> oh, snap. We got some barbecue ribbies. Going to eat me some of those in a minute. I would eat ribs, depending upon how long they've been sitting out there. I do this rib dance. And... <laughs> Alright, so this is my bunk. I got a great view. That roof is only just for decoration. Clearly somebody designed it as an afterthought. Got an oil drum over there to keep my oils in. A box. A lot of trash on the ground. Do I eat all this? Honeycombs? Fromps? I can't read that. Got bags hanging up. I hope this guy's not a loud sleeper. So, all in all, this one is really outdoorsy. My allergies would be going nuts because I'm allergic to, like, most of the things that are in life. Could eat those ribs, and I do like that there's water because water is good. Otherwise, I'm going to say... Two outdoors, allergens, a lot of trash. I don't know if that's going to change anywhere, but I do like this space. It's a great view. Probably be really good for your mental health. So we're going to give this a rating of... I'm going to crunch the numbers, carry this. Hey, oh, I right. got a calculator set to the wrong mode. Hey, how's it going? Okay, 72.4. 72.4. How's it going, Manny? Yeah, thanks, Manny. All right, so let's take a look at these guys in here in the infirmary, which is really unsanitary. Look at that. I mean, they got the sawdust in the ground for the pukers. But everything else, man, come on, y'all. Basic decency. Yo, Dink, good to All right. See you. Hey, man. You too, boss. I'll see you later, though. I've got a bit. Hey. Gonna dip. As the kids say. Okay. Next stop, this is Hot Springs, famous for their hot springs. Go ahead and check these guys out. All right, got a bridge right away. This is cool, good safety measure. Um, there's some waters out here, probably fresh water, potential source for fish if you're not allergic, which I am. Otherwise, drinking water, perpetual tire fire. Ode to Springfield there. Um, let's go across. Show y'all the inside of the outside. Open it up. He's okay. Yeah, he Except is. Drifter comes in. Down yeah, like this drip. What? I should years. come back there. No. Can't do that. I am going to let you know More I heard better. you. So you feel Tell bad about your prejudice. Coming. Okay, bounties at the gate. Easy to turn in. This one's a little bit more open. Kitchen up front, selling all this stuff you collect. Kind of raw meat down. Ooh, good stew going. I don't know why you're looking at me, ma'am. You've got a job to do. Okay, little camp out up here. Not exactly clean, but a lot of wood in the back. I mean, I feel like We're everybody here out. should have access to timber. Pile right there. Let's move it on up a bit. <laughs> All right, so down here looks like it would have been a former area set up for tourists. And I can't tell if that's a lazy river, but if it is, big points, right? Everybody loves a lazy river after a day of killing some freakers. Come over here, you can play your guitar and relax for a bit. Got some drinks and beverages on hand it's not clean but it's kind of like dirty in an acceptable way you feel like you could spread out at night and nobody would be around if you wanted to stay up late and talk if you wanted to sleep in you feel like people would leave you alone got some fields down here i'm going to help y'all you know by being on this bike here see this this is good strategy. Yep, you're doing great. Keep going. Keep going. I'll help you dig some rows. See that? 
Excuse me. And there you go. You can dig up all this. There you go. You're welcome. Okay. Muddy areas. I don't know about all the mud, but it, I guess that's just going to happen everywhere. Okay. Digging or a mask grave? Not really sure. Fishing out here. Oh, look at that. Set up for doing some laundry. That's kind of good. All right. That's nice. And she's scrubbing out stuff over there. Another good use for the water, especially if you don't know if you're drinking out of it. Okay. These guys seem a little bit more organized. Plenty of tents. Got all your gear laying around your outside of the areas. Another fire. Okay. Could be a potential... Oh, look. See, now these guys are at least taking care of their trash. He's not very good at it, but they're getting it burned, which is good for the pollutants. But at the same time, if I'm allergic to any of that mess, it's just floating right down here into my face. And it does seem like the smoke's blowing this way. Okay. Farming. I wonder if farming is more enjoyable whenever you've been out all day. All right, so here's the area where I would be kind of sleeping in one of these types of spots, right? They have these little coves. There's one there, there's one here. This is a bigger one. I do like it. It feels this is a little bit more safe. There's a sense of community. I like that they have those special pedestrian friendly fires. It's really good. I hear people coughing. I hope they're covering their mouth and washing their hands. Okay, another workstation down there. That's kind of cool. Got a, got a little barbecue. A lot of coughing over here. Y'all hearing that? A little bit concerning. All right. This is mine. Okay, no immediate, you know, rain protection. A little bit odd, considering all of these over here at least have a lean-to. But, see that? Just like a cot. It's like Some tents around me. Hear a bunk but here's the weird part I've noticed at this camp, right? I'm gonna go ahead and grab some shut-eye. And almost every time when I wake up, it's going to be somebody out there just hovering. Ready to go back at it. See, now this is nighttime, right? Okay, it's cool. This is pipes over there. I hear this girl talking. And I don't know why. Nobody's out. All these guys are asleep. It's about like it should be. Clearly, people get out at night to tend the fires and then get back in their bunks. Okay. Rock, rock, <coughs> barbecue pit, coughing. Easy, right? Okay, now watch what happens when we sleep again. Okay. Bam, Let's wake go. up, somebody's sitting out there holding their hands over the dirt. Like, almost every time, does she watch me <laughs> sleep? Hey. I don't know, I don't trust her. Would she steal my stuff? I mean, the camp looks kind of cool, but I don't really have a great way to store anything here. So, you've got size, which could be a pro or a con. We've got a lot of good farmland, which is definitely good. Um, the, the areas to sell stuff are kind of spread out, but it's still walkable. There's Tuck over there. If I go close, she's going to make me get a job and work, so I'm going to steer clear. So I could see some benefits. Don't seem to have all the vehicle parts, bike, right? but it is so much more orderly. So let's go with pros. It's orderly. Got a ton of room. Got a lot better organization of sleeping arrangements. Some cons could be they got a ton of room. Not sure if that's great or bad don't really know how safe it'd be sleeping there all night with people hey, right outside. Crunching the numbers again. 
And a score of 21, this gets 18 point C. So good. All right, on to our next one, Iron Mike. Iron Mike has a spot over here by the lake. It's a choice location. Okay, right away we see he's got a bridge lined with cars and debris, which could be a strategic move. Given how it's wide open here, see, nobody's gonna come from the lake side. You're protected on this side's got a bit of the marsh, which is actually a plot later on. Some of them get stuck hey, back there. Someone's here. Yes, somebody is here. The man with the pink bike. I saw a dresser drawer out there. Open I might need to come gate. back and drag that to my area later. Put my CDs in it. So, uh, All right, so... Ago, we were up by crazy lilies, just scavenging, you know. Okay, merchant, right away. Like the shop, already looks better. Tons of parking, but why this, right? Why is this car here? Just shove it. It's a plot device we can do. Just shove it. All right, got yourself a guitar up here. Overlooking the marsh. I would think the bad guys come from there, but clearly it's not a big deal. Picnic table, fire, wood. In theory, if we ever get vehicles to work, we could use those. Folding chairs. Good, good. All right, so this section for working on the bike, I already feel better. I feel like I could trust him with my bike in here. Oh, you know, Buzz. He's got a lot of gear. But also, if he's working on my bike, it's not going to be out to the elements. This thing is... Right? Completely oh, look at that. Working on a pick -em up Tons of boxes and trash, so these guys may not have a good handle on those parts. Infirmary, though, check this out. Inside? Yeah. Not just among the pine needles and everything else that was at the at uh, Copeland's camp. Got yourself a double-sided fireplace. Those things are toy. Maps on the wall, got some vials and real medical looking stuff. I'm already feeling better. All right, let's take a peek. Let's go this way. Nice tree. You can climb that thing. All right. So it's like a mini island almost. Not quite, but it's pretty close. Looks like they're having a used car sale up here. Check out those flags. Out in the shit a few months back. We saw uh -huh. a bunch of freaks. Damn horde. Um, you think okay. Group together like that for a reason. I mean, yeah. Like a. I don't know if these people have a job. No. The mines they won't are let gone. me run in between them. I remember reading about it. Uh, the you remember reading about it? Mm. Okay then. Something to the brain, frontal lobe or something. Well. Slackabouts. So we have this giant clubhouse up here, which is probably where the uh, yacht club or somebody lived back in the day. Pretty good. You could do some decent sized meetings in here. When I first saw those, I thought those were those old school floppy disks. I think they're just folders. They got skizzers and was that a three hole punch? Three calculators laying around there. Maybe a good spot to do your homework. Okay, maps, lamps, shades. Carvings, books. I hope people still read. All right, get out. Look around. A nice big tree right here. Kind of like the mist. A little fog. Let's go around the back side. I've only been here, I think, for one quest. Otherwise, I just stick to the front tire. All right, got a spot down here. Wonder if there's anything worth looking at. Drying lines. Ooh, somebody way back there working. Got some clothes and a single sock. Hey, you're Sorry. working hard. Better than talking about being out there and seeing freakers. You, you just watching paint dry? You watch it clothes dry. Not as fun. Yeah, whatever. Wasn't watching. <laughs> oh, can't go under it. Okay, so all this looks really good. It's promising. 
Then you get some of the sheds like these over here. And this is where I would be staying, which already is world's better. I got a stationary drill press out here, handful of tools, table clamp, chair to watch the stove. See that? Dry up my own clothes inside, because I know how the rainwater works. Oh, it's going to be hard to get to the john like that. But look at this, a whole bed inside. Got a leather chair there. Got my gun locker. I don't know if we get running water, but there's stuff in the sink that implies it might be kind of there. All right, so this is the place, right? This one is where we want to be hanging out. We could sit out here. We got a shotgun pointing up. I'm not entirely sure that's safe. That's Boozer's bike. He's out here knocking around. Ooh, a hand truck. Kitchen. A little far from the other ones, but it looks like a good kitchen. There's people stationed here. Ooh, what are you making? <gasps> ribs. These are getting pretty banged up. Yeah, I'll right. eat some of them ribs for you here in just a minute, boss. Okay. Okay, Will Barra. What are you up to? Hey, somebody knocked your stuff in the water. Did you see that? Maybe you're in the wrong place, buddy. Okay. Huh. Well, what are you going to do now? You're welcome. All right. And away. Hey, camping chairs. I wonder if we can borrow those. Is there a system for relocating chairs? Can we just take them and use them if we put them back? Or do you need to check them out? Found a rake. A lot of bikes. Still not to do with the busted up, broken down vehicles everywhere. I'm like, just move them out of the way. We could use this place to play kickball or something. So, good donut spot. Look at that. See, now they're going to remember this. Look, look, look. Go, 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 go. All right, let's wrap this one up. This is the best because private room, a lot of area, great donut spots. Just really solid in general. Probably some negatives. But I didn't see too many fires going, which is great. And... Yep. So, this one scores. And it wins best in show. And just like that, we're going to take off and have a great afternoon ah. with our... Oh. Ah. I'm okay.